So this tutorial is going to be fairly self-explanatory, which I love because figuring out whitelisting or allow listing on Meta has been absolutely impossible for me in the past. I don't know why, but they have made it so much harder than it actually needs to be. So without further ado, let's quickly dive in. The document that I'm going to be referencing is provided by Meta and I'm going to be linking it in the description below. But make sure that you're logged into your Facebook and on the left side, you're going to see Meta Business Suite. Go ahead and click on that. And then you're going to look on the left side again and click the drop down in the top left corner. You're going to select the business portfolio you're looking to connect. You will see a settings icon. Now you may have to do two-factor authentication. Make sure you choose the one that makes the most sense for you. Now once you get into your business portfolio settings, you're going to go to users and select partners. You're going to go ahead and click add and then select give a partner access to your assets. This is where you're going to copy and paste the partner business ID that your client would have provided you. Now you're going to select the asset you're looking to give the client access to. For me, it's going to be select all and I'm going to give them full control as far as business tools in Facebook goes. In layman's terms, everything except for sensitive actions. Obviously, only share what you feel comfortable with and also what you've agreed upon. Click assign assets and voila! You've assigned your assets to the point of contact that you're looking to do allow listing with. And if you did it correctly, it should show up under partners like this. 